It is to meet this threat that we must maintain our soldiers in Germany and anywhere else in the world where our treaties and alliances demand it of us. For the Seventh Army in Europe, Germany is the frontier. Men who have completed their tours of duty are replaced by well-trained men fresh from the United States to keep the authorized force unweakened. The 2nd Armored Division is a key component in the total strength of the 7th Army. Privates Buczak and Byrne, replacements fresh from the United States, are entering a strange and foreign world, but which at the same time is a familiar one. Neither speaks a word of German, neither has ever been beyond the borders of the United States before. But the men and the routines they meet at the 2nd Division's headquarters in Bad Kreuznach are fully familiar. Moreover, they are joining a unit with proper pride in itself, with high esprit de corps. The room Buczek and Byrne will share is a comfortable one. However, it will serve only as a home base, for men on duty in Germany spend anywhere from one-third to one-half of their time on maneuvers or in training in the field. The second division is a ready outfit. For the replacement, the transition from home to foreign service is made smooth by customary army routine. Private Buczek is a specialist, a tank gunner. He is acquainted with a wide variety of tanks and weapons, but his job now will be to know one particular tank inside and out. He will learn its individual peculiarities, its own special temperament, Men of the Second Armored insist that tanks have individual personalities. The good tank team knows and appreciates this. Even though the tank itself packs enormous firepower, the tanker does not neglect his own weapons. The 45 automatic is to the tanker what the M1 is to the infantryman. 